Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you the game between Akshaya Kalai Yelahan and Maria Nevio Selaya. Hmm, nice names. Which country is Akshaya Kalai Yelahan from? Can you guess? It's easy to guess, isn't it? The name says it all. Akshaya Kalai Yelahan is from UK. And Maria Neville Selaya, she's from Belarus. This is the game from Chess Olympiad, women's section, that was played in Norway in 2014. Akshaya Kalaya Lahan. Oh, to make it easier, should I give them short names? Uh, let's call them short names. Black and white. Is that better? Or you prefer to hear the names? Very nice names. Okay. Akshaya Kalaya Lahan played d4. Maria Nevio Selaya played d5. Knight to f3. Knight to f6. c4. c6. Going for Slav or semi Slav defense. e3. Bishop to g4. Developing the bishop before playing e6. Knight to c3. e6. Attacking the bishop. Bishop to h5. Unpinning. Knight from b to d7. c takes on d5. e takes on d5. So if c takes on d5, after bishop comes to d6, then knight can attack the bishop. So we have e takes on d5. Akshaya Kalai Yalhan Castle Kingside. Bishop to d6. b3 with the idea to play the bishop to b2. And Maria Neville Selaya Castle Kingside 2. Bishop to b2. Rook to e8. Rook to c1. Connecting rooks. Regrouping. Rook from a to d8. Black came out alright from the opening. Do you agree? solid position. Knight from b to d2. Bishop to b8. What is the purpose of this move? Can you guess? The plan is to play queen to d6 and then queen to h2 check, of course, after the defender of h2 is removed. We have rook to e1. Bishop to g6, knight to h4, playing with fire. Queen to d6, threatening queen to h2. g3, blocking. Black to move. What would you do? Maria found one very interesting move. Can you? If you wish, you can pause the video and you can try to find the best move for black in this position. Did you pause? Come on, pause and find Maria Nevio Celaya. Capture the pawn on e3 with rook. Kaboom. Pawn takes rook. Queen takes on g3 check, forking the king and the knight. Knight to g2. Okay, what did black get? who has sacrificed rook. For a sacrificed rook, Maria got two pawns plus the attack. Black to move, how would you continue to attack? I think queen to h2 comes to mind. Check. But Maria found a more precise move. The most precise, knight to e4. We have knight takes knight, bishop takes on e4 threatening, queen takes knight, checkmate. Bishop to f3, bishop takes bishop, queen to d2, defending the knight on g2. Black, play the move and white resigned. What is the move? Maria Nevio Selaya. 
play the queen to h2 check and Akshaya Kala Yalahan resigned in view of this continuation. King to f2, queen takes knight, check mate. Or if king goes to f1, then check and after king to f2, queen takes knight, check mate. What a beautiful attack. And let's go back to this very critical position of the game. In this position, Maria sacrificed the rook. For two pawns plus the attack, would you be brave to sacrifice the rook for two pawns plus the attack? That is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your king hunt and bye for now.